after Cragnorth's great escape from Helen, he found himself in the town of Riverwood, thanks to his new friend Rolla. And today, we will see Cragnorth open a new chapter in his life and take another step on his path to power. Hello everyone and welcome back to our Skyrim playthrough and today we are going to be doing the second part of our playthrough and as you can see Kragnaroth has been upgraded, we have gotten him some new armor, we have gotten him an iron greatsword and if you want to know how I was buffing him up then well here's your proof of how I was buffing Kragnaroth up. So I hope you guys enjoyed that epic montage. Now what we're going to be doing today is we need some gold. We desperately need some gold and we need to level up Kragnaroth a bit more. So like every adventurer does in the ancient times, we're going to go look for some freelance work. And as you can see, I've unlocked a whole lot of places, you know, Brizzlesian Pass, Forts and stuff. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be going all the way down back to Riverwood. We're going to be doing some work that we will eventually find by the bartender i guess because you know ancient time now if i've learned something it is that you know from the innkeepers or the bartenders you can get a whole lot of freelance work because you know they get the bounty letters from the guards and you know you can basically become a freelance bounty hunter for them so the clients eventually you'll have to run all the way up to the clients and get your money but that is what we're going to be doing today. As you can see, we're pretty low on gold because 400 gold isn't really much. We can't really get anything at that. So we'll have we'll have a whole lot of stuff to sell once we go through killing people, looting people, and if we if we hit a bandit camp, then well, all is good because if we hit a bandit camp, you can literally loot the bandits themselves. So yes, let's see what kind of a bounty hunting adventure we'll embark on today. In Skyrim and we're gonna be asking the innkeeper of the gi sleeping giant inn. Okay so here we are at the sleeping giant inn and let us ask the cook here I believe and we will get some work. You're that visitor been poking around. Yeah so I've been poking around. What's your problem Delphine or whatever? We got rooms and food. Drink too. I cook. Okay. Need a room? Talk to Delphine. For work. Got any leads? Yes, sir. We need some Here, work. Take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. Okay, so where do we have to kill the bandit leader located Until at the halted time. stream camp? I'm just the cook, lad. Well, if we have to kill a bandit leader, then mm -hmm. I hope we're gonna be going towards a bandit camp because hey, we can get a whole lot of loot from bandit camp. But we're gonna have to run all the way past White One. Okay, well, might as well embark on our journey. Alright, so that's White Run over there. Well, we're not that far off. Alright, so we have officially arrived at the outskirts of White Run. And as you can see, this is a farm right here. I think this was the Pelagia farm or something like that. Yeah, that's right. That's if the pronunciation's wrong, I'm sorry. What's that over there? Did I just hear fighting sounds? Okay, what's going on? Someone's using Oh, a giant! Heck yeah, let's get some of that. Hopefully I don't die. Die, you vile creature. Yeah. There we go. Who are these people? Okay. Fight with us and you'll have stories to tell. Come up to your Vasker. 
if you're worth it. Your vast your companions, all the companions. The most famous warrior band in all of Skyrim. Have you been living with the Horkers? Apparently, I have. I have escaped when from Helga. Arrive, blood is spilled, and our blades sing to the glories of Eastmoor. Well, a mercenary band, maybe. This is hmm. life, brother. Call the mercenaries or heroes. I don't know. Reminds us to draw breath. I see potential, people. If we join them, we can surely level up. Handle yourself well. You could make for a decent shield, brother. Oh, thank you. What is a shield, brother? An outsider, eh? Never heard of the companions? Well, I have. We're warriors. We are brothers and sisters in honor. And we show up to solve problems if the coin is good enough. Not for me to say. You'll have to talk to Codlac Whitemane up in Gravaska. The old man's got a good sense for people. He can look in your eyes and tell your words. Well, isn't that if you great? Go to him, ah, well, we'll go ahead and join the companions once we're done with this bounty hunting or whatever. So, this guy doesn't have an interest in loot. Let us still go towards our bounty hunting. Man like you need suppose so. Got one all saddled if you've got the coin. Suit yourself. Okay, so here we are, finally, after walking my legs off, we are finally here. And I believe I should get ready for battle. You can already see the dots pulling in. Oh, okay, the people are really eager to meet me. Okay, this is gonna be hard. Thanks. Darn mages. Die. Okay, really running low on health. You have archers too. Right now I'm running low on health potions, but where is the archer? I don't see him. Die! Man, these kill animations are awesome. Oh, that's something I really like. Right, so I looted all the bandits and our target is in there, so without further ado, let's go. Okay, so going in for a sneak attack right here. Let's see if it gives you lots of speed. Great. He literally told him where I am. Yeah, I made it quick for you. Easy. Alright, I'm gonna quickly loot up everything over here and let's move on. Alright, so I decided to take that guy's iron armor and equip it because it gives more better protection. And our target is down here. Let us quickly get some destruction going on here. And you'll find out why, because um Unfortunately, I died once before because I did not equip the iron armor and the bandit leader here is pretty strong. Get this off. Die. Okay. This guy's gonna be tough to crack because his armor is pretty good. Okay. Out of stamina. No worries. Easy minced meat. Collect the bounty from Preventus Evanesi. Well, I guess that's the Jarl of Whiterun's um, right hand man, I guess. So. We're gonna have to go to White Run finally, and we're gonna have to forcefully go forward with the story too. I'm gonna take this guy's armor, I'm gonna loot everything, and I'll see you guys back on the road. Okay, so we are to work White Run. It is closed with the dragons about. He's official business, about business only. Official business only. Okay, well, I come with news about a dragon, or should I just intimidate him? I feel like intimidating him, but well, our guy's a humble guy, so he's not gonna do that. He's gonna say the truth. Riverbird calls. For the Jarl's aid. The woods in danger too. You better go on in. You'll find the Jarl in Dragon's Reach at the top of the hill. Well, it seems like we're gonna have to go to Dragon Reach. It was Dragon Reach, right? Or was it called something else? I don't know. I forgot the name of the Jarl's place in White Run. So, White Run discovered. Yay! Okay, we finally takes, found White Run. We must have more swords have for the Imperial soldiers. In town because I really need that bounty. I just can't. And. Well, pretty much, this is what I have to do. 
Collect the bounty. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna have to talk with the Jarl anyway, so... We'll get two things done at once. This is the wrong place. That's the tree, I guess. Do you get to the cloud district? Oh, gotta keep running. Of course you don't. Okay, so we're in Dragon's Reach and Preventus of a VC or whatever his name is of a VC is right here, and there's the Jarl. Okay. What's the meaning of this interruption? Jarl yeah. Balgruf is not receiving visitors. Well, I come here with urgent work. I have news from Helgen. Well, Gerder sent me. House Carl, my yeah. job is to deal with all dangers that, that threaten from the Jarl or his people. They're gonna throw me right back so there. So you have my attention. Now explain yourself. I just did. The dragon has destroyed Helgen. Now I was told to get the message directed to the Jarl. Yeah. Whatever you have to say to the Jarl, you can say to me. It's I'm right, starting yeah. to think. To think what? Well, that's weird. You just said you're starting to think and just shut up. Oh, this is where I'm gonna have to get the What's bounty. What's this about Riverwood being in danger? Yeah, I'm not gonna get my bounty anytime soon. Yeah, Riverwood Good. got the a dragon got Owns Riverwood. There. the lumber mill, if I'm not mistaken. Pillar of the community, not prone to flights of fancy. And you're sure Helgen was destroyed by a dragon? This wasn't some stormcloak raid gone wrong. Well, well, I'm just gonna say I was there. I don't want seriously. I don't want to give off that I was being executed right over there. By Ismir, Irelith was right. What do you say now, Preventus? Hey, boy, give me so my bounty. Continue to trust the person the is busy. The person is busy. What? The dragon? My lord. Well, we I, had to, I ran all that way once. for nothing. It's in the most immediate danger. But this is part of the story, so listen carefully. We'll view that as a provocation. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should Enough. not. I'll not stand idly by while a dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people. Irileth, send a detachment to Riverwood at once. Yes, my yarl. Okay, we got one thing done. I'll return to my duties. That would be best. Well done. You sought me out on your own initiative. Not exactly. Done I was here service. for the bounty. And I won't forget it. Here, take this as a small token of my esteem. That yeah, I'll is that another armor. thing you could do for me. Suitable for someone of your particular talents, perhaps. Come, let's go find Faringar, my court wizard. He's been looking into a matter related to these dragons and... Rumors of dragons. Dragons. Uh, do I really want to find out about? No, I don't want to find out about dragons right now. I want my darn bounty. Where is this guy? All the standing around. Hey, come back here. Or give me my bounty, man. And he's gone. Great. Okay, now would you be kind enough to give me my bounty, please? The reward for the bounty. I killed that bandit leader. Excellent. You've done us a great service. Of course, I did you a great service. Here's your reward. Okay, you're scamming me. That is not worth a hundred gold. I did way more work. But anyway, let's go check out that dragon stuff Enjoy or your whatever. Visit to drag okay, let's hear what he has to say about the dragons or whatever his research or something. Far and I think I found someone whatever who can it is, help I hope it's you with worth your my time. dragon project. Go ahead and fill him in with all the details. So the Earl thinks you can be of use to me. Oh yes, he must be referring to my research into the dragons. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Well, when I say fetch, I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone tablet that may or may not actually be there. Ah, no mere brute mercenary, but a thinker. Perhaps even a scholar? You see, when the stories of dragons began to circulate, many dismissed them as mere fantasies, rumors, impossibilities. One sure mark of a fool is to dismiss anything that falls outside his experience as being impossible. But I began to search for information about dragons. Where had they gone all those years ago? And where were they coming from? I, uh, learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in Bleak Falls Barrow. A dragon stone, said to contain a map of dragon burial sites. Go to Bleak Falls Barrow, find this tablet, no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. Simplicity itself. An old tomb, built by the ancient Nords, perhaps dating back to the Dragon War itself. 
Ah, maybe you just want to know how to get there. It's near Riverwood, a miserable little village a few miles south of here. I'm sure some of the locals can point you in the right direction once you get there. Well, must preserve some professional secrets, mustn't we? I have my sources. Reliable sources. Alright, so first things first, we are going to go straight to fight towards the storyline right now because that's a main storyline mission. Mm -hmm. Instead, to buff Kragnaroth up, what we are going to do is we're going to join the Companions. As you can see right here, in the miscellaneous, they have speak with the leader of the Companions. So, that is what we are going to do, but before that, we're going to go down to the trader, we're going to trade some stuff and get some gold. Alrighty, so that was very profitable because now we have 886 gold as you just saw. And now we're gonna head straight towards the companions and you know join them. Hopefully they do take us in because I don't know if they will or not, but hey, you never know. This is Skyrim. A whole lot of unexpected stuff happens now and then when you don't expect it. So let's hope for the best and let's go into your Vasker. Whoa, okay. A hardcore fight taking place right here. Hmm. Are they gonna stop or are they just gonna keep going? Well, I'm gonna speak to the leader of the companion, so he's gonna be here. So let's select that. Uh, why did I open the console? Okay, so it's he's right over there. Okay, underneath. Should I? Yeah, let's get a piece of this action. Okay. Well, you guys started the fight, man. I'm I'm here to you know stop the fight. I'm the mediator, if you may. Okay, this is okay. I think I, I think this is a bad idea, man. Come on, you got this, Kragnaroth. One down. There we go. Cinematic kill. Easy. If you see two people fighting and you want to stop them, strike them both down. Simple as that. All right, let's go towards the leader of the companion now. Enough wasting time, I guess. Okay, so there's a stairwell which leads into this hall, and the last room but is the room of the leader of the called companions, Black. called Black White Man, I believe. Our to bear. So, they're but talking, let's have a talk. A stranger comes to our hall. Yes, I'm a stranger, but I would like to join the companions. Would you now? Here, let me have a look at you. Okay, look at me as much as yes, you want. Yes, perhaps. A certain strength of spirit. Master, you're not truly considering accepting him. Hey, am I not I good enough for you? I just stopped the fight upstairs Last for you guys. Checked, Come on. Had some empty beds in your basket for those with a fire burning in their hearts. Apologies. But perhaps this isn't the time. I've never even heard of this outsider. Oh, but you will hear Sometimes about me, man. Don't worry about that. To us. Sometimes men and women come to us to seek their fame. Um, I don't know about you, but I'm not here to seek any fate, but I'm here for the gold and the leveling up that comes with it. Of so, course. How are you in Well, battle? you're asking if I can battle. Yes, I can handle myself. I just took out two people upstairs. So. This is Vilkas. He will okay, test your arm. Okay, he wants to test Vilkas, my arm. Take him out to the yard and see what he can do. I Okay, he wanted us out in the yard and here we are. So let's see how he's going to test out our arm, I guess. The old man said to have a look at you. So Let's do this. All right then. Just have a few swings at me so I can see your form. Okay. Don't worry, I can take it. Oh, that's a whole lot of big talk. Pretty good arm you have there. Not How bad. about that? Next time won't be so easy. You might just make it, but for now, you're still a whelp to us, new blood. So you do what we tell you. Here's my Wait sword. Go take it up to Yorland to have it sharpened. And be careful. It's probably worth more than you are. Wait, wait, wait. What? I was supposed to become a mercenary and make money, not become an errand boy. Bruh. Did we just get scammed? I feel like this was a scam. Ayala the Huntress told us we would get good coin. Bruh, this is just... Oh, man, come on. What brings you here? I'm here for an errand. I'm guessing you're the newcomer, then. Oh, don't worry too much about it. They were all whelps once. They just might not like to talk about it. Ah, so this is how it goes Don't always just do what you're told. 
Nobody rules anybody in the Companions. Oh, that's so. Okay, I remember that. Well, I'm not sure how they've managed it, but they have. No leader since Yzgrimor. Kadlak is the Harbinger, and he's a sort of advisor for the whole group. So I talked to Every an advisor. Own, wow, that's nice. A woman, her own. I have a favor to ask. I've been working on a shield for Aela. My wife is in mourning, and I need to get back to her soon. I'd be much obliged if you could take this to Aela for me. He just said, he just said don't work for anyone. Yeah, well, Kragnaroth is a good man at heart, so why the heck not? All these young ones scampering. Alrighty then, let's give the lady her shield. One of them. If you wish to hunt with me, I have your, shield. your feet need to be quick and your eyes quicker. Ah, good. I've been waiting for this. Good to see you made it up here. Thank you. This one? I saw him training in the yard with Vilkis. Haha. <laughs> Already making a name ah, for myself. Yes. I heard you gave him quite a thrashing. Don't let Vilkis catch you saying that. Do you think you could handle Vilkis in a real fight? Well, I don't like to brag, but uh Yeah, I don't care for boasting. Hmm. Yeah, let's say that. Ragnar's good at heart. Ah, a man of action. Yeah. Here, let's have Farkas show you where you'll be resting your head. Okay. Let's Farkas. see. So, so we're accepted. Oh yeah. Did you call me? Nice. Of course we did, Ice Brain. Show <laughs> what this a roast. new blood where the rest of the whelps sleep. New blood. Oh, I remember you. Bro, when Come did you on, see me? follow me. Oh, he saw me. Uh, I think he saw us when we were at the farm. I guess. I think that's where you were. and Ayala like to tease me. But they're good people. They challenge us to be our bet. Your bet? Okay, well, that's, that's nice weird. Nice to have a new face around. It gets boring here sometimes. Well, I'm glad I to be here. Keep you. This can be a rough life. You have no idea of what here. rough you've Just stick a bed and fall in it when you're tired. Telma will keep the place clean. She always has. All right, so here you are. Looks like the others are eager to meet you. Come to me or Ayala if you're looking for work. Once you've made a bit of a name for yourself, Skior and Vilkas might have things for you to do. Good luck. Welcome to the Companions. Alright then, that's the what way, we do. If you're looking for something to do, we've gotten a letter about someone needing some muscle right here in Whiterun Hold. I don't know what the fight is about, and that's not our business anyway. I just need you to go out there, look tough, and scare this milk drinker into submission. No more than that. I don't want to hear about a killing, understand? All right, I can handle that. Why not? <laughs> Go. Bring honor to yourself and the companions. All right then. By the way, if you're looking for something to do. Okay. Yeah, thank you. Well, let's see. So this is where we're going to be sleeping, huh? Pretty cool. Alright, and that does it for part 2 of our Skyrim playthrough, and I hope you all enjoyed it. I hope you guys are enjoying the series as well, because I've already done a part 1 of the playthrough. If you haven't seen it, then do go check it out. Link is in the description, or the video will be popping up in the end. So, next time we're going to be going into the companion missions, and you're going to make some gold. But, yeah, that does it for this episode, and I hope you all enjoyed it. Do like and subscribe to support me, and I'll see you next time.